What up guys, Malone6 here, and just to let you guys know that I've been making this series since I was 7 years old in 2013, and out of the sake of completion, not views, because I don't think anyone's going to watch this now in 2020, this game's kind of outdated, my favorite dirt bike game, best ever free ride that the that this series have ever made and I wish they would make it backwards compatible I would play it a lot or remaster it or something um, I have talked to them in the past but the company that bought THQ no longer has the the files for this game because it got lost in transfer when they purchased the company or something I don't know but I did talk to them about it um, and you might be able to play it on PS in PS Now on the PlayStation 4 and upcoming PlayStation 5. Not sure though. Don't quote me. Um, anyways, uh, a friend of mine let me borrow my his Xbox 360. It's right here. I got a cheap little crappy uh, capture card that we're going to use to capture this. It'll be better quality than, than these ones were just literally a camera displayed at the screen anyways without further ado I know you guys just want to get the sprockets and get out of here so let's get started today we are going to be doing Greenfield collection number five this is the guide I've been following forever if you guys want to follow a written guide link will be in the description someone else made it uh, thanks to this guy right here so Anyways, thank you guys for watching and let's get started. I believe this game came out on December 17th, 2007 and I've been playing this game since I was 7 years old. A lot of 7's I know. Um, anyways, to remind you of my, uh, play, of my little setup here, this cheap little Chinese graphics card that I'm using, it does not work on my desktop but works on my laptop. So what I'm doing is I'm recording my face on my desktop and then here I got my little um, laptop here with the Xbox 360 underneath so that's my crappy little setup so that way I can play this game in 2020 and get an okay amount of recording out of it alright so the very first one you can actually get is just right here all you do is go straight and there's the gold one there's and you just ramp up here and get it after that you want to I made that look so easy but it took a few tries I even restarted the recording after that there's one on each um, one of these buildings here so here's the silver one and through the magic of editing I grabbed it and now there's a bronze one over here on top of this one once you grab all these three let me grab it real quick there we go grabbed it alright once you are here with all the chickens um, there's the tractor there so you where I'm at you just go up here to the right here and you'll see it in the distance and it is on top of this ramp with two traffic cones on top of the ramp right there the orange traffic cones you jumped over that uh, paved road so you want to do is get on the paved road go right it'll take you to a hangar where there are a lot of sprockets all in one spot sorry you don't need to follow the road to it alright so first one I'm gonna get you guys can get these in any order they're all over the place first one I'm gonna get is behind the fuel right here so behind the second fuel pump right here whoops next one after that is a silver one on top of a hanger there we go um, I did realize not good enough to land on top of the hanger you have to actually jump it alright now that you jump that hanger go ahead and go inside of the hanger pick up the bronze behind the plane Oh, got it okay <laughs> after that come back out to the front and there's one behind this plane. They like hiding behind planes. Ah, oh shoot, I keep dying behind the planes. All right, then go into the other hangar, pick up that easy bronze. And once you do that, we should be able to go over behind by this orange or yellow, whichever color you call it, I'm gonna call it orange, behind this huge plane. Hold on, let me tell you which plane it is it is it's a big twin engine aircraft says the 
uh, guide that I'm following. So just go around this and boop, pick that up. Um, then go back out here again and next to that big plane will be this big control tower. Um, you're going to have to ramp again like you did the hangar and try to grab this silver one. There we go. I crashed, so what? Alright. So, next, we are going to stop next to this orange dot so we know where we are on the map so you guys can get situated. Alright, so from the orange dot, you see a water tower out in the distance. So, let's go to the water tower. There will be one right there to the left of it. From the water tower, you want to turn right, and in between these two roads, there'll be one up on this little jump thing, this hill. All right, after that, get on any either of those two roads and go left. They intersect, so it doesn't matter. See, I'll show you right here. The roads intersect, doesn't matter. Go to the bridge, that's what matters. And this game loves to put sprockets underneath of bridges so we're going to go under the bridge and what do you know a sprocket this game loves to put them underneath the bridges get back on the road go the same direction we are going to come up to a bus with a trailer on the left there you go that's your mark so you know that you need to turn right and down here somewhere will be a bronze let's find it there it is and let's grab that and then go back up to the bus. All right, back to the bus. There is the bridge in the background. All right, hi bus and trailer. All right, now you just want to drive down here till you see a fruit and vegetable stand and it'll be right there next to it. I love it when they make it so easy to find these things. There's some hard ones in here to grab, but they all are pretty close together maybe it's a smaller map I'm not sure alright so there it is a vegetable stand and it's right there so here's the vegetable stand and it's right behind him hi man hey dude alright the next one will be at the next bridge so come to the bridge to the right of the bridge there's a circle on my screen for the Sun boom there it is Okay, these three can be confusing, so make sure you follow as best you can. You want to stay on the road, same direction. Don't stay on the road too long or you'll fling away because you hit the edge of the map. You want to head, as soon as you see this dirt track, you want to go left where that truck just went. So you want to go on the path. I'm going slow on purpose so you guys can follow along. There's one right here. You want to grab that. I'm not going to grab it yet so you guys can maybe get your bearings. Here is the first one you grabbed right there you want to keep following this path um, it's going to make a bin like this stay on the path and then on this row on this hill on the right here is where it is right there so you want to ramp and grab it after that keep following the path and there will be one on this berm here Okay, now I'll quickly insert a clip of me grabbing them all. Let me show you quickly how you get to where we are. So as soon as you spawn, you want to follow this little uh, crop thing. Sorry, I don't do much of agriculture and you just follow this and then you eventually go off and follow the hay bales and it'll be in this field basically follow that cyan colored um, dot until you get to the silos and then you're over here you can pick up that one at the farmhouse so say hi to the little farmer don't run him over that's rude boom there it is next to this outhouse so here's the little man what you want to do is come over here and there's one off this jump to get it you need to simply 
jump off where the cones are and grab it. Surprise, I got that one try. All right, then you want to, you saw it a second ago, but all you need to do is go towards the cyan colored dot. All right, now that you're at the cyan bluish colored dot, you need to head back towards this field and you'll see it in the distance, pretty easy to find. Okay, so I'm at the bluish color cyan dot. What you wanna do is in the distance there is a, another farmhouse. So just go straight till you see the white farmhouse there. there if uh, you're familiar with this map, it's right next to the combine. So here it is next to this farmer in his front porch. Boom, grabbed it. Um, nice truck, dude. And then go to the combine and pick that up. And you now have all of the sprockets. Congratulations. And there's the start. So if you need help finding the last one, there's the start where the gold sprocket was and just jump down and here's the combine. Now I'm pretty sure the combine will drive around every once in a while. Make sure you quit the event so that way your achievement will pop. There it is. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for being cool. Thank you so much for supporting me. Um, even though this, uh, what, this game is out of date, remember the best dirt bike is a green dirt bike. And I hope you guys stay safe, stay active, stay healthy. God bless. Peace.